Looking for the best APRS mobile ham radio? In this video, we've done an extensive review of the top APRS mobile ham radios, and we rated them according to features, reliability, audio clarity, and value for money. Price information and all radios mentioned in the video are available in the description. So let's get started. Number three, Yesu FTM 200DR, best budget APRS mobile ham radio. All right, let's dive into number three on our list, the Yesu FTM 200DR. I've dubbed this one as the best budget APRS mobile ham radio. Now, before we get ahead of ourselves, let's clarify that by budget, I'm specifically referring to its stellar APRS capabilities. This isn't a cheap transceiver by any means, but when it comes to bang for your buck in the APRS department, it shines brightly. Yesu FTM 200DR is a versatile radio handling full APRS in both digital and analog modes, armed with a built-in 66-channel GPS receiver for top-notch location accuracy. With its 1,200-9,600 BPS APRS APRS data communication, this radio is a robust tool for all your APRS needs. And guess what? Being a part of Yesu's Fusion series, it comfortably supports the C4FM digital mode and communication. Switching from conventional analog to digital mode is fairly easy and seamless. When working as a conventional mobile radio in analog mode, it's a power player with a true 50 watt output for TX on both VHF and UHF. While it doesn't flaunt a true dual band feature, it grants you the ability to scan both bands which some might argue feels pretty close to the real deal. Plus, it can receive airband, so it's definitely wearing a lot of hats and wearing them well. Installation? A breeze, my friends. Yesu smartly designed the faceplate to be removable, offering greater flexibility in where you can mount the unit. It also conveniently houses the controls, complete with bright central screen and easy access menu items. Audio quality is thumbs up thanks to the 3-watt speaker that delivers crystal clear sound. If you're longing for wireless freedom, the Bluetooth connection comes to your rescue, although you'll need to shell out some extra for a Bluetooth access unit. Now, it's inevitable to compare the FTM200DR with its sibling, the FTM300DR. They're similar in many ways, but the FTM300DR boasts a true dual-band receive and two VFOs for simultaneous position transmission while engaged in a conversation channel. Still, the Yesu FTM200DR is a standout radio. Full APRS crisp audio and easy handling of various settings make it a formidable contender. Its highlight include a sturdy build, a micro SD slot, recording and snapshot functions, a removable faceplate for easy installation, and smooth switching between analog and digital modes. On the flip side, it lacks a true dual band due to a single receiver, and Bluetooth is only available through an optional accessory. Also, it could be a bit of a task to switch the radio into crossband mode. So how does it score? For features, I'm giving it an 8.5 out of 10. It earns a 9 for reliability, an 8 for value for money, and another 8 for audio clarity. That puts its overall rating at a respect. 8.5 out of 10. So overall, Yesu FTM 200DR is a solid APRS performer that won't break the bank. Number 2, Yesu FTM 500DR, best premium APRS mobile ham radio. Yesu FTM 500DR is the company's new mobile radio with digital features, launched in April 2023. Though relatively new, it is already making waves and is amongst the best APRS capable mobile transceivers available at the moment. It's certainly no slouch when it comes to APRS, sporting full APRS communication capability at 1,200-9,600 BPS. What's more, the APRS setup is pretty straightforward and can be handled directly from the radio. Although, as you'd expect with APRS, there are a few steps involved, but I assure you, it remains easy. Now, let's talk about this unit's interface, because it's got a little something for everyone. Prefer touchscreens? It's got one that can handle a host of functions. More of a buttons and knobs person? Yesu's got you covered there, too. In fact, a large dial on this radio is a visual treat, and a tactile delight light to use. While the four other dials at the corners are conveniently placed for volume, squelch, function, and sub-dial adjustments. Installation-wise, Yesu's done their homework. They've made the faceplate detachable, which really gives you a lot of flexibility in terms of mounting options. It's not a compact radio, but with the faceplate removed, the body is decently sized, allowing you to get creative with installation. And check this out. It's got RJ45 mic connectors on both the faceplate and the body, so you can choose whichever suits your needs. Being part of Yesu's Fusion series, it can TX and RX on both 144 MHz and 430 MHz, and it has airband RX. Plus, it's compatible with Yesu's C4 FM digital mode. Now, some of you might remember the now discontinued Yesu FTM 400. The FTM 500 DR is its successor, and although the FTM 400 had a larger touchscreen and a fab grid menu, the FTM 500 DR makes up for it with a still great looking display and the added charm of the large VFO knob. Plus, its PMG or primary memory group function is super smooth 
In conclusion, the Yaesu FTM 500DR is a top-tier mobile transceiver with an intuitive interface, superb speakers, and outstanding digital and APRS capability. Notable features include full APRS, solid build quality, Bluetooth connectivity, a micro SD card slot, and a user-friendly interface. That said, it is on the pricier side. There are some issues with DTMF decoding, and switching the radio into crossband mode can be a bit of a task. In terms of ratings, for features, I'd give it a strong 9.5 out of 10. It scores a 9 for reliability, an 8 for value for money, considering the price point, and a 9 for audio clarity. This brings the overall rating to a solid 9 out of 10. So there you have it, the Yaesu FTM 500DR, a premium package for those who want the very best in their mobile ham radio experience. Number 1. Anytone AT D578 UV3 Plus Tri-Band, our top choice. Now time to dive into our top pick for APRS-capable mobile ham radio, the Anytone AT D578 UV3 Plus Tri-Band. This bad boy is riding the waves of radio greatness, especially in the realm of DMR. But man, don't get me started on any tone's confusing name convention. Talk about muddy waters. This sturdy piece of tech can TX and RX on 144 to 148 megahertz, 420 to 450 megahertz, and even 222 to 225 megahertz bands. It's like a band ninja. And guess what? It's got air band reception too. Compatibility with DMR tier 1 and tier 2 means this device is ready to take you on a serious listening journey. Let's not forget it's cross mode and cross band compatible with a max transmit power of 50 watts. Its DMR game is strong, folks. I'm talking up to 4,000 memory channels, 10,000 talk groups, and a whopping 500,000 contacts. It even has a taste for DMR roaming. It's not as smooth as Motorola's patented tech, but it's up there. Trust me. One of my favorite features is the Bluetooth compatibility. The device comes with a Bluetooth PTT button and can work with any tone's Bluetooth remote for extended functions. The remote can increase your options for installing the radio and handle most functions, including APRS. Speaking of installation, though, the lack of a removable faceplate does limit your options a bit. The radio can TX and RX APRS data in digital and analog modes, but it's limited to location data services only. Still setting up and programming the radio for APRS and general use is pretty straightforward. It connects to your computer via a micro USB cable and can be programmed using the company's free software. However, a word of caution, AnyTone's documentation isn't exactly a walk in the park. If you're new to DMR radios and AnyTone's interface, you might need to hit the books. Some sellers, like Bridgecom, include a setup course, which could be a real lifesaver. In a nutshell, we love the location-based APRS. The sturdy build, the Bluetooth connectivity, DMR repeater roaming, cross-band and cross-mode compatibility, the three bands TX and RX plus Airband RX, the decent TX and RX quality, the hefty contact list, and the smooth transition between analog and digital modes. On the flip side, the programming software could be a little user-friendlier. The included manual leaves much to be desired, and the installation options are a bit limited due to the non-removable front plate. Now let's rate this rating. For features, it scores a 9 out of 10. It bags another 9 for reliability and a 9 for value for money, and an 8 for audio clarity. That brings our overall rating to a strong 9 out of 10. Ladies and gents, the Anytone AT D578 UV3 Plus Tri-Band. When you're looking for top-tier performance in your mobile ham radio adventures, this one's hard to beat. So what do you think? Which of these is the APRS mobile ham radio for you? Or do you think another ham radio is better? Tell us in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Have an awesome day.